Hello everyone, it's Teddy, and today we are going to be opening another tin. Today is the, what is this thing called? Waking, Walking Wake. I, I'm not up to date with all the Pokemon, I'll just be completely honest. Uh, I never played Scarlet and Violet, never played Sword and Shield, never played Sun and Moon, or Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, but I'm familiar with most of the Sun and Moon Pokemon. Actually, I guess I never played Black 2 and White 2 either, but... Regardless, last time we opened this Iron Treads tin. Now, a big difference you'll notice about these is that this one stated on the back that it came with five Pokemon TCG Scarlet and Violet Paldean Fates booster packs. While if we go over to our ally here, our other one we just got today, it only says five Pokemon TCG booster packs. So. What I assume this means is that we're getting random packs in the boxing, but we'll find out now. So let's just open it up and get started. All right, first thing to look at, our walking wake, very pretty, snow pattern built into that. Looks great, can't complain. And I like how there's a little bit of sparkle on the eye too. Fantastic detail. But yeah, I think that's enough admiring that. Let's see what packs we got. All right, wow, quite heavy. So we have, are they all upside down? Or I guess I'm holding them upside down. All right, so we got Twilight Masquerade, Twilight Masquerade, Temporal Forces, Obsidian Flames, and Obsidian Flames. So we're gonna put the Obsidian Flames over here. We're gonna put the Twilight Masquerade, I guess right above it so you guys can still see it. And, we're going to start with the Temporal Forces, I think. So, let's move this and get it out of the way for now. Pack that all up and put it... You know what, let's put it... Eh, no, we're going to put it off screen, let's be honest. You've seen enough of it. All right, Temporal Forces pack first. Ten additional game cards. We're going to hope that the pattern hasn't changed from the last pack opening I've done, or else I'll be a little bit sad. So, I felt that it, like split a little bit over here, so I'm hoping I can get that to happen again. Okay, I don't know why I felt that. Let's just tear it open like a mongrel. Okay, nope, try the bottom. Nope, no luck there either. All right, now we're in it to the hard part where we have to... Man, I do not understand how people tear these packs open like the absolute... like absolute animals. I'm struggling so hard to get one pack open. Okay, I've got it. We've got a tear. There we go. All right. So, the good news about these new packs is now the backs don't reveal anything. Before, it used to be that if your pack had a green outside or green code card, then it meant your pack was bad. But now, packs are all about the same. So, first off, please hope this is an energy. Please hope it's an energy. It's an energy. Okay, thank goodness. So now I know that this is the uncommon and this is the rare, so I'm gonna slip that in between. And let's open it. I've never seen any of these cards in Temporal Forces. Totodile. Deerling. Know all these Pokemon so far. Pit of. Great. Pineco. Yes. Behem, Behem, I, I've never been able to pronounce this Pokemon, but I've, I'm have familiar with it. Ancient Booster Energy Capsule, Ancient. The ancient Pokemon this card is attached to gets plus 60 HP, recovers from all special conditions, and can't be affected by any special conditions. Cool, but seems really niche. However, it boosts your Pokemon, so I guess that's good. Rapidash. And what have we got in the back? Oh, that wasn't the back. All right, what have we got in the back? Melmetal. Okay, so this card is in the back for some reason. Don't know why, but Melmetal. Got a little sparkle on it too. Oh, look, it's hollow. Hollow Melmetal, very nice. Oh, it's not the last card, Carvana. Okay, so, huh. So that means I pushed Melmetal ahead and this Carvana was in the back. Okay, this Carvana was in the back because it's hollow. Okay, cool. 
I think we got our pattern down. I just miscounted the cards two times in a row. So that was our first pack. We'll put those all right there. Uh, not extraordinary, so let's move on to the next one. We're going to start with the Twilight Masquerade packs. Hopefully these ones open a little better than our first pack, so I don't have to claw at it for too long. All right, try from the bottom. First try didn't work. I try and get some speed so that that works for me, but again, I screwed up there. Let's try opening again, like so. All right, I always get it eventually. All right, and we've got another cruddy uh, Pokemon Live. This is the energy, yep, psychic energy. I'm gonna put that right off to the side and we're gonna slip this in front. All right, turn it around. Here we go, the room. Now, if I didn't know better and I didn't play Poke Rogue, I'd think that's a fake Pokemon, and I th I'd think I'd get scammed. But now I know that's a Pokemon. It's Metal Poison, which is actually super cool typing. Volby, Luxio, that's Gen 4, my home gen, I guess you could say. First gen that I really was, like, conscious and able to play. Goldeen. Iron Bundle, that's kind of cool. We got a future Pokemon. Okay, cool. Festival Grounds. Not interested in trainer Pokemon. Florgis. Carmine. 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 Carmine's probably right. And what's in the back? Frostlass. Okay. So, not great, but we got a nice, beautiful hollow here. Or, I guess, a beautiful print. And we have our hollow. Very cool. All right. Well, let's go ahead and plop these down here. All right. Second Twilight Masquerade. Or do we mix it up with an Obsidian Flames? I'm thinking we do Twilight Masquerade. Just keep it simple. Hopefully one of these actually rips like I always see all the YouTubers do. They just seem to rip it open with such ease. But I haven't even gotten one to rip open like that. I always have to do the finicky thing at the top to get a tear going. All right. So we have the pattern now, and I'm going to assume, since this is, they're all scarlet and violet, that there is, uh, they all follow the same pattern, energy. And we're going to flip this energy card in front of the, uh, sorry, second to last card. Because that's been working out well for us. All right. Slugma. Slugma dick. Very cool. All right. Swirlix. I'm familiar with a tad bulb. Never, never heard of this Pokemon. But, you know, I'm sure it's cool. Applin. Okay, this is, this was stupid when I heard about it. But, whatever. For, I'm gonna try. Farigraph. Farigraph. Okay, that's actually not that hard to pronounce. It's just stupid. But, cool. Ryfort? Is that a name? Well, whatever. Ryfort. Diplin? That's cool. Love dragon types. I'm still amazed that dragon type has been added to the game. It just feels like it's so cool that they added a typing so late. Wattrel? And again, let's look at that pretty print. They did such a fantastic job on that. And what have we got in the back? But a Hisuian Arcanine Hollow. Okay, not bad looking at all. I love the new Hollows. They really actually stand out. And these new, like, print cards look great, too. Okay. So we're already a little, I'm going to be honest, we're already doing a little worse than our last one. However, that's nothing to scoff at because we just got really lucky on our first pull, I think. All right, we're going on to Obsidian Flames. Hopefully Tyranitar does us well. Also, these look like Dynamaxed or what is it? Terra Pokemon. Oh, there we go. Our first successful rip. Maybe this will be our pack. All right, get the code card off. This is our energy, basic water energy. And we're gonna flip this card behind the new last card. 
which was the second to last card. So, also get this out of the way. Shuckle. Let's show the whole card for once, Teddy. Not stop being so amateur. By Sharp. Magneton. Temple. Linoon. Skarmory. Wugtrio. Diglett. And. Gita. Okay. Gita's pretty, though. Pretty card. Very nice. Look at that shine. That that shine is just glorious. I, I've got to say, nothing's going to beat that. Yeah, so far, I think I like the five packs of the same type better because it feels like you are more likely to get something good out of one of them because maybe they come from the same booster box, presumably. But we saved the best for last, or at least what everyone else thinks the best is for last, Charizard. All right, Charizard, don't fail me now. You've never done me right, and we can just pray that this will be the one time you do something right. You're worth the most. You definitely do that the best. Okay, all right, and this one's not coming off easy. Well, you know, that means there's a good card in there. Uh, let's hope, at least, because there was not a good card, or, you know, a high-value card, uh, usually, in the last couple. Okay, and we will take off the last one. We got a fighting energy. Fighting, fighting for a good card, you know? Uh, I'm sure this means there's something good in here, and we're gonna slip that second to last card in front of the last card, or sorry, the last card in front of the second to the last card. Now let's look into it. Weasel. Bounce Sweet. Magnemite, all Pokemon I'm familiar with. I, I mean, Bounce Sweet, honestly, I have no idea how to know that. Larvesta, love this art style, by the way. The photorealistic background with the clay-like Pokemon on it. That's my favorite art out of any Pokemon. Letter of Encouragement. Chandelure. Patrol Cap, and I think these are our last two after this. One, Altaria, okay. I think this is our first dragon type with that beautiful art on it, that absolutely stunning gear pattern, energy pattern. I love that. Great, Altaria. And what have we got last? Thunderous. Okay, Thunderous is a cool Pokemon. But I have to say, this pack, or these packs, were definitely not as extraordinary as our last ones, where we got... I believe we got three EXs, one being a hyper rare, and the rest just, you know, being really cool, you know, EXs. One actually was a shiny, and I didn't even realize it. So let's quickly recap what we got in that box. The big thing is that, the nice thing about tens, I guess, is that you guaranteed get that walking wake. So really, our big pull from this box was solely the promo walking wake. Which is okay, you know. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose when it comes to Pokemon cards. And I guess this time we lost. So, yeah, that was the video. And, you know, please, please subscribe. Please. But really, no. I, I actually appreciate it if you subscribe. So, please subscribe. I need it. I need it. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you all later. So, bye-bye.